This problem is slightly more complicated. So before we can use the product rule, we need to make sense of all these square roots. So this can be rewritten as one plus x three over two. This x to the minus three is fine. And this would be represented as two x to the power of third. We now have this in a way where we can see what the indexes are and we can differentiate them easily. Let's do the same as what we did in the previous question using this formula. We can now find out that u is one plus x to the power of three over two. So du dx would then be three over two x uh, to a half and v would be x to the minus three minus two x third. So dv dx would then be minus three x to the minus four minus two thirds x to the minus two over three. We can now substitute all of these into here. So we're going to now get one plus x to the three over two minus three x minus four minus two thirds x to the minus two over three plus x to the minus three minus two x thirds times three over two x half. We can now expand this out, which um, you do by um, uh, the standard quadratic factorizing. Um, and I'm not going to run the whole string, but you should get your dy dx to be minus 3x minus 4 minus 2 thirds x minus 2 3 x to the minus 5 over 2 minus 11 over 3 x to the power of 5 over 6. So be really careful when expanding this, it's doing that. And then this would just be applied on both terms. You will then get a long string that you then have to clean up. And this would be your solution.